We have new developments to share with you in the case of missing baby Gabriel. A judge has decided co-defendants Elizabeth Johnson and Tammy Smith will be tried separately. ABC 15's Kimberly Chang is following this case live outside the courthouse. Uh, Kimberly, the baby's father was there for the decision. What is his response to this? He says he is frustrated. His son has been missing for about a year and a half now, and he's not getting closer to any answers. Johnson, the baby's mother, was in court yesterday. She is facing charges in connection with baby Gabriel's disappearance along with Tammy Smith. The baby went missing back in 2009. Johnson was in court for the first time in months. Authorities say Johnson was the last person seen with the baby. Smith faces allegations of conspiring to adopt him illegally. There had been talk that Johnson would testify against Smith and call her the mastermind. Now the two women will have separate trials. Outside the courthouse, Gabriel's father says he's not sure he'll ever get closure. You know, it's never going to go away. It's always going to be there and it's always going to hurt. I'm just trying to get on with my life a little bit as much as I can, work and do anything that I can to you know, just keep my mind off of it a little bit. Meanwhile, Johnson's lawyers are trying to get her case dismissed, claiming that a detective in San Antonio questioned her early on without her lawyer's pres uh, presence. A motion to dismiss hearing is set for May 25th. Johnson's trial is set to begin August 8th. In Phoenix, I'm Kimberly Chang, ABC 15 News.